assessing this. Cosmos? I didn't activate it. Protected subject detected and vital signs confirmed. Immediate assistance is required and initiated. Nothing about your own pain, concerned only with the welfare of another. So beautiful. Oh no, he's here. Can't you heal my pain? The pain in my heart from being abandoned by you. What has my wayward little doll been doing in this dreary place, huh? Don't tell me you've become infatuated with these things. No, she's just... If I take her life, would that finally bring you back to me? If you saw her crimson flesh, would the sight of her weakness make you regret running away from me? All you're trying to accomplish. <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> you're a far more valuable prize than the Zohar. You're all the same form of imitation, and your appearance will deceive him. Dangerous here. I will now take you to an evacuation pod. Hold on! Someone was with me! Unfortunately, there are no other signs of life detected in the area. Ships 
fire main cannons. was destroyed in the battle. Logic Drive is down. Engine output is down to 45%. Emergency core shut down. Switch to reserves on the double. Wait! Engine room unresponsive. Our commands don't seem to be getting through at all. Updated field report. Eggs losses have exceeded 70%. Where's Cherenkov? What happened to our first officer? LPS overload! I can't locate him! Just as I thought. No question. Those damn Gnosis want to get their hands on the Zohar! Captain, defensive perimeter has been breached by the Gnosis! Bastards! What do you mean the bridge was destroyed? Let it go. Always remember our chief allegiance is to you, Tick, not the Galaxy Federation, Commander. Do you understand me? Yes. Status. We've linked to the main field generator, sir. It'll only hold for three minutes, but we'll control the output. Bypass to the logic drive secured, Commander. You can take control from this terminal now. That's fine. Good work, men. Commander, I object. Purging this block and attempting a gate jump? It's suicide, sir! Objection noted. But all that matters is that we get this to Commander Margulies. That is all. There's no time. Get in the pod and evacuate. But Commander, I... Hurry up. That's a direct order. Stay alive. We still have undeployed life pods aboard this ship, gentlemen. No one withdraws until evacuation is complete. We got movement! I won't be able to take you the rest of the way. I hope you can forgive me for this. Open fire! You're out of danger, so quit your whining, huh? That thing was built to protect humans, so that's what it did! Look what you did! Sir, these readings are off the charts! Oh my god, Hornst! Dying like lowly worms. 
Shion. <laughs> the tortured cries of the dead are so loud they're bursting my eardrums. <laughs> but you will sing a much better song, capricious one. Activated. Look, we gotta get off the ship right away. Everyone else is either evacuated or dead. How's she do it? The Hilbert effect materializes the Gnosis and makes them vulnerable. Don't the Kirschwasser Reallians have that too? Xion. Yes? We'll now proceed to Hangar 1 quickly. There's a 99.998% probability that the Gnosis target is the object stored in that hangar, which my database says is the Zohar. My assigned duties are to verify and preserve the integrity of the Zohar, and to protect the Vector staff members. Who gave you assigned duties? I will now break through these Gnosis so we can get to the hangar without trouble. Please be ready to move. Now the enemies have been exterminated. We better go. Uh, okay. I don't get it. Why can't I purge this block? I know I didn't make any mistakes. Protection of the valued object has failed. There is one remaining life pod docked at the end of this duct. Huh? Hey! From this departure point, there is a 75.4% probability of survival. Hey, that's just another way of saying 24.6 of us are going to... Whoa! But what will you do once we leave, Cosmos? I'll continue my assigned duty using the Case B strategy. We really have no time for this. Case B? Xi'an. The ship will be destroyed shortly. What? Later.
There's no way I'm dying in a place like this. Yes, I have confirmed that the target object was not the original Zohar. Yes, it was an emulator. Roger. Upon deploying tracking device, I'll depart immediately. As originally planned, I'll head for second Milsha and make contact. Them are dead now. Oh, Chief. I can't stand it. I don't want to see any more people die with this in the accident. SOS went out a half hour ago, so we've probably got at least three hours. No sign of any nearby ships either, right, Hammer? Yep, yep. From what I can see, we're the only ship within a 5,000 light year radius. All right. That should be enough, fellas. We got time, so let's grab anything that looks salvageable. You know, Captain, I realize the deadline for paying back Master Guinan is right around the corner, but don't you think this is a little risky, even by our standards? If the Feds find us out, we'd be lucky to get ten years for what we're doing. Yeah, you're right. But that's if they find out. Well, right. What I'm trying to say is I just don't like the idea of feeding off the dead. I mean, what are we, space jackals all of a sudden or something? Or maybe vultures or laughing hyenas? <laughs> you moron! What kind of a metaphor is that? They're all extinct animals, Mr. Matthews. Yeah, and we're environmentally friendly space recyclers. Master Guinan told us to stay away from any side jobs, remember, Captain? He said it hurts the Foundation's image. I don't know about that. What's this? Looks like we got a wrecked ship here at 3 o'clock. Looks like a Ganymede class, too. Nice work there, Tony. Good thing we were tapping into the UMN emergency channel when we were. Come on, pull in close, hurry. Yep, yep. We're vultures, all right. What was that? <gasps> huh? Whoa! A body. Hey, not only that, it's a girl body. She might be cute, you know? <laughs> oh! Please open your communications line now. I need to speak with you all. Frequency 2020. Oh, it's a talking corpse! You moron, this ain't a corpse or a ghost or whatever. Must be some kind of cyborg weapon or something. Hey, this is Captain Matthews of the Tramp Freighter Elsa. You mind telling me? <sighs> I will make this brief, gentlemen. From this moment on, the navigation of this ship will be carried out according to my direct instructions. Shimmering so bright, got a light divine, flung along the sea. A fading stardust 
Freighter Elsa by force. I meet a Realian girl named Momo and Ziggy the Cyborg. More adventure coming your way next time on Xenosaga, the animation, Chance Encounter.